they put my most wanted champion in a progressive chance event, so I gotta go for him. What's up guys, MTG Jedi here, how you doing today? My avatar has been feral for a while now, and they put him in a progressive chance event, so obviously that means I have to try for him. Also, it will help. I'm going to get a little bit more um, ancient shards here if I need to. Um, but it will help uh, pulling this in this couple days here for these progressive chance events. It will help your ability to complete this crazy champion training monster path over here. Now, I have completed a fair bit of it. And I have 55,000 points. I have some... Five stars that I can level up. I've done all of the two to three to fours to fives. Now I have the five stars so I can level those up. Uh, you know, just put some levels in before I use them as chickens. And then I can level up a bunch of new six stars if I want to. Um, but I would ideally like to get both. I would ideally like to get both and then mess around with that. For fun and interesting stuff and for also those of you who are going to go for these things now with that being said i how good is he how good is he he has an a1 decrease speed which is nice he has a a2 decrease accuracy block buffs and an a3 perfect veil on all allies except this champion okay but here's the thing he has this passive where he's gonna reduce your damage as well so this is like a duchess type champion but also brings block buffs now he does not bring a revive and i don't know that he's gonna bring much damage um i i haven't tested him or anything i have no idea but i do have a team crafted just for him and he would pair really well in that team with our friendly neighborhood blade master that we all got on logins so let's try to get lucky this morning and pull some shards um if i don't get him it's okay but we're certainly going to try let me know, obviously, if you're pulling. I assume if you're pulling, you're pulling for Duchess. Um, I would advise the majority of people pulling for Duchess, not Feral. However, if you already have Duchess and not Feral, then that's why we would be pulling. Unfortunately, I will not be able to be streaming. I think that that's true. I don't know when this video is going to go live, but just check my Discord. Um, check check your notifications to see if I'm going to be live pulling shards. Okay, so let's jump in. Let's see what we can get. Um, my goal anytime we're pulling is to try to get legendary champions. And then uh, hopefully those are the ones in question. But at the end of the day, when you're pulling shards, if you're really committed, then you want to try to come away with legendary champions. That's going to give you the most opportunity to get the 10x, you know, oh, 10x, the progressive chance champion. But if we get him, great. If not, it'll be okay. Um, but I think that, you know, being that he is up there in terms of my most wanted champions, is he like at the top of my list? Pretty, it's a pretty short list, honestly. And then tomorrow, Elva is there and, uh, there's a progressive chance event for her. I still never got her, still never got her. At this point, though, it's been like a year, and I would have used her a lot during this year, but I don't know how much I would use her now. I probably would, but I don't know. Um, okay, let's go, let's go get some gems. Um, I have not seen any pack offers, but I also don't really want to spend money, um, as I have done so <laughs> for a few other things. 
probably that video will drop before this video because it's more time sensitive we can post a shard opening video on any day and it'll be perfectly fine um however what you do need to go back and make sure you have watched is the video on the new gear set i outright bought the forge pass all the levels for the first time ever i have never done that um in in fact it's pretty wasteful but i wanted to see if i could get a nine piece set for you guys to test it so you know how good it is and i did i got it so that video should already be posted by the time this video goes live so make sure that you go watch that because that is one of the most important videos that i've made on the channel in my opinion and I don't know how that turned out yet, because we're doing this first. So that's an interesting little uh, time loop conundrum here on the channel. So make sure you go check things out. And we are Legoless right now. Um, baloney. Uh, okay, I'm going to level some champions up and make some more space. We need a legendary champion. Okay, this was easily made. We had uh, a bunch of commons and uncommons, you know, one and two stars, so that was easy. We have all the epics. We need legendaries, though. Need legendary champions, and I don't really want to use all my gems. I already used way more gems than I wanted to. But this is the conundrum. All right, so... We are obviously over a hundred shards here. Never lucky. <laughs> Let me know if you're pulling. Are you pulling for Duchess today? Because like, okay, here we go. Rickdoff and Cupidus. I mean, that's a sick pull right there. Rickdoff and Cupidus. Um, I know that I have both of those champions. But Cupidus, that is a dupe that I will take. That's a dupe I'll take right there. Because I have a plus two, I want to say. But I have been considering, like, with the new gear set, Cupidus would be really good in the new gear set. He has an AoE A1 and A2, and usually I shut off his A3. So, like, if I was able to get the accessories for the nine piece i think that would be really good on him um and i've been debating on if i got another one would i level it up to, instead of empowering him or i could just make him plus three so either way that's a good pull for me uh and then we're at 25x but i just don't know if i am willing to go that far in order to get another one like, that would probably be another couple hundred ancient shards. Oh, that's so frustrating. And, like, why does Plarium not want to sell packs? Like, that's shocking. Like, there should be, like, uh, you know, a hundred ancient shards for $90. We'll just, like, speak that one. Um, <laughs> all right, let's... Let's pull some sacreds while I'm considering what to do about the ancients. We are at the full 25x. Hmm. Okay. I guess let's pull some sacreds. Um, I'm gonna scoot myself back over, I guess, a little bit so we can see the sacred shard count. Um, if you have a preference on where I'm at on the screen, let me know. There we go. Ah, oh, Saito. If there was less going on in the game, this is a guy who I would want to test in Hydra. If you have time and you want to do that, like put him in some crazy gear and let me know how it goes. I feel like this kit could be well suited for Hydra, but I don't know that I have time to do that. So if you're up for that, let me know. Man, I wish there was like a CVC going on or something. We get uh double dip for all these shards there we're not we're not getting any uh additional benefits for pulling these shards today Ugh. okay jareg 
Come on now, come on. We got three legendaries, which is actually above my expectations. Like, do I want to spend all my sacreds? I really do not. Okay. That's actually a very good clan boss champion. I have no I still don't know how to say her name. One of those champions that I don't know. I just can't figure it out. There's no logical way. But she's very good though. Husk, spoilers. Okay. Oh jeez. I told myself I was only gonna go down to eleven. But I would like another legendary. So let's keep going. Let's keep going. We're deep here. We're deep in it. I really wish, I really wish we were double dipping here. But at the same point in time, I don't know. I mean, Feral, he's up there, like, as one of my most wanted champions in the game. Like, I have to go for it, right? Oh, there will always be more shards. I feel like at this point, targeting champions that I really want in the 25x would be like the best idea for my account. Let me know what your opinion is about that. I would like to know. I would actually really like to know what you guys think about that. Oh my goodness, these sacreds are brutal today. There we go. Oh, Rathmatab. Uh, I thought this guy was going to be so good when he came out. He's just not. Why? I don't know why he's not that good, but he's not good. I'm just all in here, I guess. I'm going to go... No, the clan boss did not reset. I was gonna... I'm going to go check for a sacred shard. Wow, jeez. Jeez. Did I not have? Did I not have it selected? Oh. No. Oh. I hate everything right now. I didn't click the select it. I'm not editing that out. That's super important for this. Oh my freaking goodness. I didn't have it selected. Oh my goodness. Alright, I've calmed down. <laughs> I probably won't have time to edit some sweet clips in there, but can't just imagine. Let me know what kind of sweet, uh, hilarious clips would you have put in there uh, if you were me editing. Oh, man. But anyway, I got more Ancient Shards since I did that one correctly. Make sure that you don't make this critical mistake um, when you're trying to pull for a progressive chance champion. So, um... Wow. Anyway, it, it'll be okay, but uh, right now, not feeling good about it. Not feeling good. I'm also used a majority of my gems to get these shards. Um, I didn't purchase any shards this morning, I would just say. So of all the days where, you know, uh, you're like, geez, what a whale. Um, this is resources that I've been saving, okay? This is resources I've been saving from earning the shards as well as um, saving up gems. Now, of course, probably some of the gems were purchased, but, you know, I didn't purchase anything today for this. That's not to say I wouldn't have. <laughs> That's not to say I wouldn't have. All right, or we're just, we're just literally all in. We're just literally all in. I, I'm going to just keep going until I get another one and see if I can get the 25x. 
I'm getting down to, like, my, the last of my gems, though. So, like, I don't want to just go, like, buy all of that. Like, hopefully we can just get the Lego right here. All rares. Cool story. Okay, next one. Just remember, like, when you're having a bad weekend, just know I know how you feel. Okay, I know how you feel. When you're having a bad shard pull event, I know how you feel. All right, we're running out of resources here, but I said I'm all in, and I'm pretty committed to doing everything I can do. Like, <laughs> oh boy, I have so many regrets. Um, can we time travel back to the beginning of this video and tell me to do something different, please? <laughs> I will certainly have lots of champions to train after this. Okay, now I'm not going to go pull eight singles. Uh, clan boss is about to reset, so hopefully we can get like one or two more and do a final ten pull. If we're lucky, we'll get a sacred. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. L last, last leg of the journey. One, one second. Ooh, I almost forgot to hit unpause on the last one. Okay, we got three ancient shards from Clan Boss this morning. Uh, let's do the single pull. Okay. And then, and then the ten pull. Please. Oh, we... Okay, hold on. Hey, if you made it this far into the video, thank you so much. And uh, I probably need to give away some gems here at the end of the month so put your um player ids in the comments below and for those of you loyal people who made it this far you'll have a chance at winning 540 gems um so let's let's do the last 10 pull um player ids in the comments below one lego to finish the video or not or not I don't know what else to do. I don't know what else to do. I guess that'll do it for me here today. Um, yeah, all the ancients, all the sacreds, hundreds of ancients, uh, twenty-two sacreds without the ten, without the progressive chance boost. Give me your sympathy in the comments below, and I'll see you guys later. Mm -hmm.